All right. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. It's Tragic Life here. And we are in the midst of Rydia's storyline in Final Fantasy for the after years. Charlie, get back down here. Hold on. Charlie! 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 Go to mom. Sorry guys, he, um, we didn't close the gate, so he ran upstairs. He's not allowed to be upstairs by himself. Okay, so we dealt with the sealed cave. We tried, we went and got the crystal. And then we ran into the mysterious woman who beat us up, broke our toys, and stole our crystal. So we left the underworld to let people know what's going on. And our robots, our teammates, woke up and are ambushing us for some reason. So this is going to be fun. Kalka, Brina, stop it, both of you. That lightning strike. Their behavior circuits must have gone haywire. I, I can't do anything. Luca, we can't keep this up. Don't lay a finger on them, Rydia. What? Okay, just let me deal with them. So you just want me to take a beating? I mean, they use lightning. I can't even use items. What the heck? These things are strong. Why weren't they strong like this when we were fighting? When they were on our team? That's crazy. They weren't this awesome. Okay, I think he's done. Yeah, now it's time to beat up Brina. Okay, so we got it. Well, Luca. Cannon fire. I thought we were sneaking in the back door. It's the Red Wings, they're trying to shoot us down. Losing altitude, yeah, that means we're about to crash. Time for an emergency landing then. You mean crashing, right? That's what emergency landing means. Well, shucks. Mm. Yeah, that's that's about right. Luca. Luca. I'm okay. Are you though? Are you really? Luca. House Kalka, Brina, I'm sorry. We took some serious damage. Yeah, we crashed. Do you think we can fix it? Just who do you think I am? Huh? 
I'm Sid the airship man. That's what they call me. Just let me at that thing and I'll get her back up in the jiffy. That's what your master would be saying right about now, isn't it? You're right. See? There you go. Bless you, baby. We'll need to find some parts for the repairs first. All right, let's go. I mean, the next question is, where are we? Okay. Okay, so we're near Agar. Cool. All right. How much money do we have? We have plenty of money. So... I don't think we need to stay at the end. We do need to stay at the end. Okay. So, first off, what are you doing? Get out of here. Oh, hello there. I'm Naming Way. Since my encounters with Cedar, I've been working under the name Challenging Way to offer new challenges to travelers. It appears you have some unfinished business left to take care of, however. Would you mind coming back to see me once you have progressed further in your adventure? I'm assuming this is where the bonus dungeon is for her. Cool. All right. Get out of my way. All right, so they should have a room armlet. All right. Sage's miter is pretty good. Okay, so it's better. It, the miter is better in ways, but it's not better in the intelligence, so we're not going to get it. Uh, especially since we're going to be using the healing rod for a lot of healing. Uh, we're going to pass on that armor. Because the higher your intelligence is, the better it works, from my understanding. But we do got a room. Alright. So that's good to know. Um... Da -da 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 -da. Okay, so we want to rest in the inn until we get the new moon. Um, so let's see how much it costs. Maybe we'll get lucky and we'll get it on the first time. I'll buy two of these. One of those. Five of those. Okay. I think we're good for the moment. Uh, mine's packed with monsters, so make sure you're prepared for battle before you go. How much you cost? 100 gil. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and pause this until we get the new moon phase. It's going to make sense, apparently, once we get it, so I'll be right back. Alright, welcome back. So I also leveled the characters up a little bit and bought a lot more high potions. Um, now we just gotta find, uh, this cave. Uh, I get a feeling it might be, it might be right there in the middle, huh? Get out of my way. Get out. Is this it? Okay, so that's not it. Um... So, apparently the new moon phase will give Luca's big throw a big boost. Um, not really sure where we're going here, so hold on. Might be that right there. Oh, right there. Okay. Uh, this feels like a new area. I don't know if this was in the first game. Um, so, we'll play by. I got a high potion, but I... Oh, did I just start a second thing? No. Whatever. Alright. 
Should be a couple chests in here that are going to be simple to find. All right, we got a remedy. We got an Arctic wind. Oh. We got an ogre, a K-Sith, and a mind flare. It's funny how much that looks like the first boss of the first Bond of Fantasy. I mean, that was the point. I get it. the exact same fight. I hear you, sir. All right. Second path is also fully linear. There is a pot. Exact same fight. Okay, I don't know if we fought a needle hog, so I'm going to let you guys watch this one. Hey, hey, we need to kill the K Sith before it like one shots us. Gotta do it. So this pot right here will give us full HP and MP, which is awesome. So we want to remember this place. X potion here. And there should be a cottage. I don't know why I did that, sorry. Right, go all the way south for Phoenix Down. Apparently this area is a little trickier. That was the Ogre, Case Sith, and the Mind Flare. Okay, go down here and to the right. I, 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 I saw it. We have Plate Mel, which is... Hmm... So it's higher defense for Luca, but it lowers her strength and evasion. So I'm gonna leave that alone as well. Right, that was another ogre case hit and a mind flare. I think we gotta go up first. Oh, we got treants. Those are new, I think. Did you just stone me? What the heck? Oh, my waste of that. Oh well. Okay, that wasn't fun. I don't like fighting anything that can petrify. Right. No, I went the wrong one. It's that one. Alright, that was another fight with Treants and... The Needle Hogs, I think they are. I don't, I was talking to it like you guys were watching. I forgot you guys aren't watching all my fights. Okay, so we got a decoy. Alright, that was an Ogre, K Sith, and a Mind Flare. Seems to be a common fight in this area. Alright, that was three Needle Hogs and a K Sith. Oh, that's what I was gonna do before I forget. I'm gonna go ahead and give you the healing rod. Okay, and ah, we'll keep it where it is. All right, that was three Needle Hogs and a K Sith, and that was two Etlin Snakes and a Cave Naga. All right, are we still on New Moon? We are. We're actually wanting to go ahead and use a cottage. to get the waxing moon and then go south to the final floor more of the needle hogs and the two treants 
they are my I'm not liking that fight at all but it is what it is all right so we're down here go right down and right okay that was two more needle hogs in it and a two tree ants uh, they're kicking our butts all right it's gonna be a no for me should be dry either that is not what I came here for uh, oh, I was supposed to go up Wear a pair of mithril gloves. Not what I wanted to do. Okay, take the left path. Should be a remedy, good. Um. I don't know if we've seen a succubus or not. I'm gonna leave it in because I'm not sure and it's worth, I mean, they're kind of cool to see. All right. Continue this way and up through the door. You're now in a room full of rocks. Here on the waxy moon, you'll, you'll fight pairs of quartal puppets. Okay, so we want to keep fighting these things because they drop. Mithril nuts and bolts, and we want one of each. Um, so I'm going to show the fight, and then I'm going to grind it out until I get them. No. Okay, so it's these guys. Oh, they have some life. How many hits? Oh. Okay. So we got a mithril bolt. So now I need a mithril. Alright. I need the mithril nuts. So I'll be right back. Let me go ahead and grind and get that. Alright, be right back. Well, that was fast. The second fight, that's exactly what I picked up, which is awesome. Um, yeah. Um, when you have the items, take the lower right path out of the room and take the right path at the fork. All right, that was two more of them. Um... Take the lower right path, which is this one. Okay. Take the right path at the fork. Five cave bats and a succubus. Not sure if this is the right way, we'll know in a second. So, all right, we got a mithril spring. And go back up and take the upper right path to a save point. I'm gonna use a cottage. I'm gonna pause it, go to the bathroom. I think we got a boss fight. Be right back. All right, we're back. I didn't read anything. I should have read. All right, so use it as you feel need. Up north, take the left path for a circlet. Two Naga and two Etlin snakes. Got a circlet. Tell me what it is. It says equip to Ridia. It gives her an intelligence boost, which is always good. Okay, so we have a boss bike coming out. We're going to go ahead. It's probably going to be this right here. So there's a trick to this bike, okay? Um, you don't want to use Rydia until this thing turns red. And then you're going to quickly cast Blizzard, or it's going to use Blaze, which is something that can definitely, it can almost wipe you in one hit. So, 
Uh, he's charged up and he is damaged by anything other than ice. He uses flamethrower, which is much weaker than blaze, but he'll retain his charge. Um, so you want to save Rydia's blizzard for this fight, okay? Uh, battle is a snap. As long as you stay on top of blaze, this battle is a snap. It's easy, okay? So let's see what happens here. Oh, well, let's, let's start it off wrong. 100% incorrect. So we're gonna go ahead and attack. Okay, I don't know. This is gonna hurt. He's gonna hit his flamethrower. Oh, we're probably gonna die. Oh, well, crap, I guess that's going to be the end of the video, um, not the ending I was expecting, <sighs> till next time, adios amigos.